didn't I tell you it'll be coming a lot sooner than you think? Yo, what's up, everybody? Welcome back to my channel. My name is Mello. Yo, make sure you click the link down below in the description to my Patreon so you can see my full length reactions to all movies, TV shows that I do. And I'm gonna start doing anime pretty soon, but let's stop the talking and let's go ahead and get right into Puss and Boots, The Last Wish, y'all. Let's get it. So it seems like every studio wants to do something like this now. They just show off all their best properties. Hey, it's cool to see Shrek in them, man. They started it all. Their theme song is actually the theme song for DreamWorks. Who was the first studio to start this? Was it Disney in Marvel? Starlight, star bright, first star I see tonight. I wish I may, I wish I might have this wish, I wish tonight. Just wanna let y'all know, I'm actually watching this movie and the first movie back to back. That looks so good right there. He looks smaller, like he lost weight. <laughs> and we will never wash it again. Oh, come on, man. Don't torture whatever girl is gonna freaking be with him in the future. Wash that boy's face. Who is your favorite fearless hero? Oh, it's not that boy Antonio can sing? Okay. Yo, they really changed the animation style up. It looks like Spider Man into the Spider Verse. A little bit. I really didn't think Spider-Man into the Spider-Verse was gonna be that revolutionary. I actually just finished watching Spider-Man into the Spider-Verse before I watched these Puss and Boots movie. <laughs> Dang, it looks so good, bro. I love the vibe. <gasps> so I wonder if the new Shrek movies are gonna be My in this animation style. My portrait. <laughs> Me oh, hell no! Minion, you lunch me, hmm. and the rest of you play double time. <laughs> Fire! Oh, yeah, I know that hurts. <laughs> Spanish spinter. <laughs> Just like the last movie, we get right into it. <laughs> Yo, I really think this is gonna be the new wave for animation. I mean, unlike Pixar, Pixar is in their own little world. I mean, he's still doing that, bro. And it look good too. This music is nice. Oh, it looks so good. Hey, you wanna see something cool? My goodness. God, that's the way to start a movie, bro. Damn, I love the music, man. One more number. I call this one, the legend will never die. Whoa, he died. Dang, that's what you get for feeling yourself, man. Shoot yourself. More for me. Uh, how do I say this? You Am I in heaven? Relax, I am pussy boots. I laugh at death. And how many times have you died already? Where did this whole nine lives thing come from? Do you like gazpacho? Uh. <laughs> <laughs> so every time this dude died is because of his cockiness. <laughs> Potter, watch. Oh my God. <laughs> Dude was looking good though. Watch. Uh, excuse me. This dude is an idiot. Oh my God. I think you said they have it. Hey, the gingerbread. Watch. Yo, what a cameo. A four? That makes eight puss. You are down to your last life. My prescription, no more adventures for you. You need to retire. Me? Retire? Are you the village comedian as well? Booze. 
That doctor is a quack and a crazy man. You should stick to cutting hair. Last call, Senor Boots. There he go. Okay, so this is how he introduced himself. If it isn't Pussy Boots himself. <laughs> in the flesh. I like that uh, shot of his face in the hey, shot glass. There's the famous hat, the feather, and of course, the boots. Don't forget the cape. Sign right there. Pussy Boots. Oh, well, why not only alive, sir? You will find your reward does not come easily. This I tell you. Hey, why are you trying to start stuff, man? He's just asking for an autograph. But no one's escaped me yet. Uh, let's get it over with. Spare me if you dare me. Slow, sloppy, yes. <laughs> okay, I can already see how this movie is going to be a good movie. Because, you know, the fact that this dude has been on top and been feeling himself. And now he comes up against this great challenge. And he has to learn to become better, you know? And get back to his roots. Oh my god. Oh my goodness. That was fire, Mero. Changing the screen to all red. I just love the smell of fear. Hey, it's cool to see Shrek and Donkey. What's the matter? Lives flashing before your eyes? Big it. <laughs> Yo, that's badass right there, bro. Oh, I can tell that whistle is gonna become a sound on TikTok, bro. People saying it's the one of the best villains ever. All right, let's see why. But the way that they going about editing and directing this movie, bro, this is fire. <laughs> That dude whooped his ass. He never lost a fight before, and this dude immediately said, all right, yeah, let me go ahead and retire. I'm scared for my life. I am no longer worthy. I'm sorry. Yo, I can't have somebody freaking have me walking with my tail tucked between my legs. Hell no, nah, bro. We gotta run another way. <laughs> but perhaps a song. <laughs> this, this dude is so freaking conceited, bro. Fearless hero. So I can understand why he came up to put some boots in the first place. You know, the fact that he's on his last life and he's talking about, I laugh in the face of death. And I'm guessing that character is death. So he was like, all right, let me see what the hell you talking about. Try me, bro. Say it in front of my face. No. No. This dude is here. <laughs> you cannot escape this dude. <laughs> That's cool that he's in the sequel. This is the end. <laughs> Damn, is that Goldilocks? Dang, how the heck does she get control of the freaking bears? <laughs> Baby, track that cat. Yo, that's pretty cool that they get these characters in this movie. What the hell do y'all want with me though? <gasps> You're a talking cat? Is that a dog? Cat. Let's talk. <sighs> I'd rather eat. <laughs> it's oh, a not dog. a problem. Kind of reminds me of like Garfield. You know, Garfield is like a, a smart cat. And then you got this dog who's portrayed as just real energetic and stupid. Want to my belly? Hmm? <laughs> What's happening? Rob! Hard buzz. Come on, Rob. <laughs> I need to practice. I'm gonna be a therapy dog someday. No. Come on. No. Rub it. No happening. Rub it. No. I, I have a feeling he's gonna get his tummy rubbed sometime in this movie. The wolf. He found me. Oh! We've got an offer for him. What could they possibly want to offer Pussy? Is that Anya Taylor Joy? Pussy and Boots. She I know she's been in like almost every damn movie now. I like that hairstyle though. It is fire, bro. Excuse me, my darling. We're looking for the legendary Pussy in Boots. Have you perhaps seen him? Too soft. <laughs> Out with it, you old biddy, or I'll have your guts for garters. Oh. Both of them sound so familiar. Oh. 
Man, I've seen videos of cats hitting lions and stuff. They wouldn't be scared of no bear. Ah. I pronounce this batch delicious. Mr. Horner, the Serpent Sisters. You need to keep his thumb away from the merchandise, sir. Excuse me? Could you do the thumb thing? It was only a nursery rhyme. Oh, yeah. <laughs> I've never heard of Little Jack. Pie. Stuck in my thumb, pulled out a book. A magic puppet. Because I'm a little boy. No. Oh, Pinocchio. <laughs> What's impressive? I've been a boy the whole time. Yeah, but you're not a damn puppet. That's what it is. You're just a human. There's nothing special about you. Baker's boy, Little Jacks. Dang. I'm so we already got like two cameos from the Shrek movies in this movie. So they telling us something. Lemon squeezy. <laughs> Kitty pulls. Kitty. <laughs> oh, I like this, bro. That's nice, bro. <laughs> it's crazy you know, that people know who she is, but she still wears you a mask to try to hide her spiritual retreat. identity. Nasty. And you're supposed to be dead. I got better? Ugh, just give us some <laughs> And throwing eyes, focus! Yo, there's real people in there. <laughs> I hate talking fair. Yo, this movie is epic, man. She did. Oh my God, soft pop. Ooh. Ooh. Oh my God. No, 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 no. <laughs> nice catching up with you, Poos. Same thing's about to happen to you. You shouldn't have done that, mate. Yeah. What is with this dude and doing this freaking spinning thing, man? He loves doing that. Look, I found a sandwich in here. I think it's tuna. Right, Pedro. Okay, now. Oh my God, the dog is driving. Oh, how adorable. <laughs> Finally, you need therapy. I had a feeling they probably broke up. Coloma. Si, Santa Coloma. <laughs> These people are terrible shots, man. <laughs> when the hell did this dude become so conceited? Oh, that was fire. Oh, I like that. <laughs> oh my God, bro. They going all out for this movie. <laughs> he still got that sandwich. I knew he was gonna do something funny. You've got to trust me. Bro, wait, with that wait, wait, beard, man, you ain't gonna be able to oh, manipulate anybody. Getting bigger. Oh, kid. <laughs> you call that cute? <gasps> oh, damn. Oh, and she did the pause, too. Wait a second. So perfect. <laughs> Yes, exactly. I know there's probably a few people that passed out over something like that. The Valley of Incineration over Undertaker Reach through the Cave of Lost. What the hell is going on right here, bro? Oh, it's whatever is in somebody's heart. That's the pathway you gotta take. What? The abyss of eternal loneliness? There's something wrong with this map. Nah, it's, it's telling y'all what's going on in y'all heart. It's telling y'all that y'all need therapy. I already know his gonna be the easiest. We skip through the pocket full of posies. What? Then drift down the river of relaxation. <laughs> that sounds fun. The star. Oh, wow. That I just let y'all know that y'all don't know what's actually going on, man. Y'all don't understand y'all problems. I've had your wish is something stupid. <laughs> <laughs> You're such a... <laughs> Posies. Pocket pull of posies over here throwing them hands, bro. Oh, thank you. <laughs> <laughs> we don't have time for this. Y'all too this negative, is... man. This is stupid. All I smell is bullshit. I guess he's not as stupid as he looks. And they put me in a sock with a rock in it. <laughs> 
and then throw me in a river. <laughs> mm. Wow, that is sad as hell, bro. Sun, and I swam to the surface. <laughs> Never found them. <laughs> I grew into it. So, I got a great story and a free sweater out of it. Win win. Dude, you didn't. Wow. Win. You that's of all people should have crazy, a wish. Crazy, man. Have a I got everything I could wish for. No magic required. I, I love his optimism, man, but damn, I wish he didn't go through that. I hate when uh, animals and kids get abused, bro. It's just ridiculous. Why would you abuse an innocent being like that, bro? They just want love. I'm gonna chop the heck out of this fight, just LaRoe. <laughs> Oh my god! <laughs> Whoa! I didn't know it was like this! <laughs> this is like a horror movie! <laughs> Why, sit on your shoulder and judge your actions and the quality of your character. <laughs> I'm your conscience. I really did have a back. Wow! Help me, Jack! Yeah. <laughs> Aren't you gonna help him, Jack? You're This is the best part of the movie so far. Look at this dude back here. This is just so funny. She's a symbol of rebirth and the eternal. <laughs> Who is this voice actor? It's just the way he's talking is so funny. Bye, perrito. Oh, that looks great. I like that. Nothing should be funny. Shh, the face I haven't seen since. Ay, Santa Coloma. What happened in Santo Coloma? You can have my gatito blade. She's like, yeah, you already know I yours is small. To get my wish. You mean my wish. You mean my wish. Man, put the dog down, man. The dog don't deserve that. All these people trying to go after these wishes and stuff, but it's only one wish. And I really think the dog is the one that's gonna get the wish. I'm gonna tell him. Don't you dare. Now, make with the map, or we'll see what the unicorn horn really does. You, 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 you're not gonna shoot a puppy, are you, Jack? Yeah, in the <laughs> face, why? So I like what they do with the action, bro. It's like they change the frame rate and everything, and they be having like some nice music going on. Stuff be getting me hype. <laughs> Already, this one is way better than the first one. Oh my God. Yo, these people are dying terrible deaths. <laughs> Damn, like a grenade, bro. I like that. Dang, what you already got PTSD and everything? Come on, bro. You can't be a bitch. Damn, man, leave me alone, man. Why you keep bothering me, bro? Push! Like, I'm not dead yet. I'm not even near death. Well, kind of. I got a lot of life left in me. This dude about to have a freaking heart attack. <sighs> Thank you, burrito. What's going on with you, puss? See, that was beautiful right there, man. See, that made me teary-eyed. I need that wish to get my life back. Okay. Oh. This is kind of like uh, the Dark Knight Rises, man. Not after Santa Coloma. But that's just one bad heist. Santa Coloma was in the heist. That dude, Batman, he was fearless. Then he went up against Bane, got his <laughs> whoop, and was scared. And uh, he learned that fear was actually a good thing. I ran away then, too. Oh, oh, <gasps> oh, you left her at the altar? It was wrong. I know. I am ashamed. That's messed up, bro. Had... Why was you scared to marry her? Thought you loved her. Give it me. Hey. No, 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 no. Ah. Ah. Don't, don't, don't do my thing. <laughs> <laughs> You're the smash, I'm the grab. I hold the map. You got it? Okay. Bro, how you get your butt whipped by a little girl? Pathetic. Oh, this was it. What was it, Mama? The day a little orphan girl broke into our cabin and stole our hearts. And stole all y'all food, too. Her fat <laughs> In the story, didn't they, like, eat her or something? The first time I ever felt fear, so I ran. It, it was a mistake. 
Okay. I completely understand because you was going into a new chapter in your life, man. And it was an uncomfortable chapter because you wasn't used to it. You didn't know what could happen. What do you think, Bug? Do I wait for the cats to steal the map and then kill them? Or do I just kill everybody all at once? You know, I'm starting to think you don't appreciate the value of a life. <laughs> what? No. I mean, I love it. I just love this dude's voice. There's good in all people. There's good in all people. <laughs> you know, Jack, maybe we need to dig a little deep. You know, I never had much as a kid. Just loving parents, and stability in a mansion, and a thriving baked goods enterprise for me to inherit. It sound like so many other people today. Act like they came from the nothing, bro. Dude, you was living in a mansion. Yo, these people do not deserve to die like this. Wait, you are a ghost, <laughs> Jack. Oh, oh! <laughs> Your wish is horrible. You're horrible. You're an irredeemable monster. Oh, oh! What took you so long, idiot? <laughs> <sighs> You're not chatty, are you? <laughs> I just—I don't know why this dude is so freaking funny to me, man. <gasps> oh no. Oh, that was in like purgatory, man. We coming Yo, they are like really doing a good job with this movie, bro. So many great ideas. Too cold. Oh, that is just right. Oh yeah, of course his freaking big self will say that, but I already know that's a part of the story, so. My goodness, teamwork at the dream work, bro. Uh -uh. Like I said, I'm the main character. I defy gravity and all laws of physics. Where's the dog? Oh my god. Caparito. Don't worry, we can track it with this. Ah! Dude, they got this freaking world changing too much, man. I think this is gonna have a negative effect. Who is your favorite fearless hero? Bro, love this song, man. What a theme song, man. You're dying to and Puss and Kitty always rescue me when I'm kidnapped, which happens a lot. Really? I think this is the first time this happened. You, you're not even a bear. Zing! Dang. I'm more of a bear than you are. She got you. Oh, Nothing, he's an instigator. Oh, I love this. Oh, that's rich coming from you, baby. <laughs> You're a daft, fat, slow thinking, no reading, Lyme disease, flea ridden, dingleberry bear. Oh, I haven't oh, got dingleberries. You do, you do have them. Dingleberry. Oh. <laughs> I'm in the mix now. Okay. okay oh, he got it. He, he a roast master. Yeah, knuckle dragging, honey scrounging, grub offish, <laughs> munching, mangy, <laughs> nugget, <laughs> and your snooter. <laughs> oh, shit. He got your. That was fire! <laughs> that was the ultimate roast. Speaking from one orphan to another, Goldie, you won the orphan lottery. I like his jib as well. Let's keep him. <gasps> what? Huh? Where'd he go? No, oh, we said no crime back. No, wait, wait! <laughs> party to party! <laughs> Pussy boots, watch along! Yeah, but how often could you live like that? Living alone, going to different towns, yeah. just partying? That would get old. It's pretty much like somebody being famous, bro. It's like people say money can't buy you happiness. Yeah, because you achieve so much and you got everything, but who do you have to share it with? Without us, you will always live a life of fear. Oh my God. You, I do love the smell of fear. It's just frivolous and but you. Damn, bro, why are you all on my nuts? I mean, why you gotta take it personal like that, bro? Come on now. Run, Bushy Bush! Magnaway! Who is this voice actor? Cause he's doing a fantastic job. For me. I had a feeling that that's why he was coming after him, you know? <laughs> Saying you laugh in the face of death. This dude took this as like a freaking insult, which it kinda is. How does he overcome this fear, man? And what's also messed up is it seemed like he's the only one that can see this dude. Shoot, what they've been doing with the villain has been pretty cool. I like where they be having like this whole red tint coming on the screen and stuff. 
What's so blasted important that you've got us stranded in this haunted forest? I'm getting a family! That's what? A proper family! Then everything will be just right! Yeah, I had a feeling it had to be something selfish with a family. The fact that they pretty much made all these oh, characters oh, like so boy. complex and that they're trying to have their own character development, man. I, I love it. But I thought I finally found that someone without a wish. I mean, you can't really wish for something like that because then it's fake. That's my wish. I... That's Goldie's wish. Oh my God, yo, I can't wait for this. And I already know they about to have this looking fire. Got a Mexican standoff. Don't got it, don't got it. You walked into that one. Oh my god, and that's the last one, and she dies. I, know. I need your help. Duly noted, but a little busy at the moment. Come on, bro. At least save one of them. Yo, how many people have died? This dude didn't give a damn about one of them. Hey, I'm gonna bust you up, Plum Fum, and then I'm gonna wear your clothes. That was gonna weird. get done up, son. <laughs> okay, now that we got this going on, I think she's going to get the wish. Or maybe she can help. You're the smash. I'm the crab. Yes! <laughs> okay, all right. I'll see you, girl. Better help out your brother. Soft boss. Yeah. What are those apples okay, supposed to be from? Bury the hatchet. No, oh, I shouldn't have telegraphed it. <laughs> Say, who's your favorite characters in this movie? And who, I mean, and uh, who is your favorite character in the Shrek universe? Maybe one life is enough. Yeah, but I'm about to get my whoop, man. I need to have extra lives so, you know, I can get that auto safe. Oh, so they can see him. But I think we've reached the end now, you and I. <laughs> I mean, not really, man. You can leave me alone. Fight! Or I can wish myself where I'm a better fighter than you. My grandpa's deck has no pathetic cards, Kaiba, but it does contain. Go on, pick it up. Can he like wish him away from the situation? Like wish that that death didn't exist? Fear me if you dare. Okay, yeah, all right, you know, people get hyped. <laughs> and this part, ooh, it's like an anime right here. Huh. Okay, I see you, what? It's kind of unfair, you got two swords and only got one, but all right. Okay, I want to know what it is that y'all love about this villain so much. I mean, he seemed pretty cool. I love the imagery and everything. I love how uh, menacing he is. You really got to stop losing that. You gotta stop cheating. Oh! Say hello to my gatito blade. <laughs> okay. Oh. oh my god. I know I can never defeat you, Lobo, but I will never stop fighting for this life. I think that's all he wanted to hear, just for you to value life. You're ruining this for me. I came here for an arrogant little legend who thought he was immortal. But I don't see him anymore. Oh, that's fire how you walked out into the fire, bro. Magic snacks. <gasps> Bro, what is this like a video game? Please? What wh what are you doing? Please? <laughs> Seriously, are you having a hernia or something? <laughs> There's such pools. <laughs> By the way, your nose is bleeding. Oh, I was just buying some time for team friendship. Team what? That's everybody now. <laughs> Ow! What have you done now? 
that's beautiful, man, that everybody pretty much got what they wished for on this journey of getting a wish. Consider this my <laughs> resignation, mister. What did I do to deserve this? The fact that you don't know is the problem. One life spent with you is all that I could wish for. So what's you gonna name him? That's a beautiful family right there. You saved my life, sis. You was gonna make the wish, but you didn't make the wish because you wanted to save your family. And I, I was really scared. Boy, <laughs> don't get so blubbery about it. Who's Man, that boy about to have me start crying. Chomper, no? I got it, I got it. How about... Jeff. Jeff? Yeah. Jeff? What is Jeff what is it with the name Jeff that's just so you funny? No, I think I'll just stick with Perrito. I kind of like it. That's what my friends call me. What does that translate to? Or is that is that really like just the name? So I got a question for y'all. What would y'all wish for? Where are we headed anyways? Off to find new adventures and to see some old friends. Oh, Yo! <laughs> Yo! Oh my god, so they're definitely gonna make another Shrek movie. Oh man, I, I already know that ending right there. People were cheering like a mother If y'all enjoyed my reaction and you loved watching this movie with me, man, like the video, share, comment down below, subscribe, click the bell so you know when I open more videos. Bro. Yo, follow me on all my social medias. Links will be down in the description below. Who's Harvey Gullion? I never heard of it. Oh, that's Florence Pugh? Oh yeah, it did sound like Florence Pugh. Yo, film editor James Ryan, you did your thing, bro. This movie is fire. Definitely one of the best edited movies I've seen in a minute. They really re revitalized this whole franchise with this movie. All right, everybody, and there we go with Puss in Boots, The Last Wish. This was so much better than the first movie. Not saying that the first movie was bad or anything. The jump in quality and just everything in general from the first movie to the second movie is just like amazing, bro. Animation was better. The voice acting was better. The story was better. And I loved every single second of it. And this is one of those type of movies I will watch so much. And I could just feel the energy that so many other people were feeling when they were watching this movie in the theater. And this is one of those movies I wish I would have saw in the theater because they had so many good cameos. Then just the whole ending of this movie, I know has so many people energetic and hype. Oh, and like I said, the question I have for you is what would be something that you would wish for? It's always cool to have a movie like this come out and just throw you completely off guard because you're not expecting a movie like this to be so good. And we had a movie like that last year or like two years ago with Encanto. I will go ahead and give this movie a A minus, man. Like I gave the last movie a B. I love this new theme song that they created for Puss in Boots. Like that right there gets me so hyped. That's something I'm gonna download myself and listen to, man. And I can tell right here with this movie that they had great chemistry with everybody. Uh, the villain, I, I know a lot of people love the villain and just saying he's so good. Me, I felt like he was cool. I, I love the imagery. I love what they were doing with him just bringing the fear out of Puss in Boots and there was a message there as well. I, I love the messages in general that they had with all the characters in the movie. But yeah, when it comes to the villain, I, f I thought he was cool. I think he was probably overhyped, but he was cool. I love the design. I, I loved what they did with the red on the screen, all that stuff. I loved how he would just come out of nowhere. I loved the whistle. His introduction though was badass. But yeah, if you would like to see my full length reaction to this movie, any other movie I do, the TV shows I do, you can click the link down below in the description to my Patreon. And with all that being said, I'll see you on the next one. All right, peace.